How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another Shaving with Surge. Today's gonna be straight razor shave number 25. And today, what I got going for you guys is Peach and Cognac from Ariana and Evans. Um, it'll be my first time using it. Brand new virgin puck, check that out. Oh yeah, with the matching splash. Brush, I'm gonna be using, bring this out, I'll be using the Craving Shaving and with the gel tip bore knot 26 millimeter check that out and for the razor i'm going to be using my w greaves and sons so this one dates back this one's uh 13 16 so dates back to 1816 to 1823 it's a wedge you see that and it's got original buffalo horn scales on it it's a beautiful beautiful razor that's the razor so let's go into the soap so this soap this new soap in the kaiser bay smells amazing and not just a sun ripened peach rather uh where did i lose my place rather warm inviting scent of peaches cognac woods and a hint of spices just the right complexity if you would expect from you would expect from Amy. This is a gourmet scent with a twist, the perfect follow-up to our Im immensely popular first release Kaizen. And the notes are bergamot, lemon, two wonderful but uniquely different peach notes, orange blossom, cognac, tobacco, absolute, mimosa, leather, vanilla, dried fruits, oak moss, sandalwood, Himalayan cedar. So it's got a lot going on in there. Off the puck. I smell the peach. The peaches, very little bit of the cognac. And that's mainly what I smell. I smell more of a fruity scent. Um, don't really smell like the tobacco or the leather, a little bit of the vanilla, but I would say this smells, it, it's a bang, it's a peach dominant scent. And, um, you know, I kind of held off on buying this one and I don't know why. I was just like, ah, peach and cognac, you know, I don't want to smell. I was thinking it would be smelling more like the booze. Um, but it's actually a, it's actually a really good scent. Really good. It's, um, I could definitely keep this in the shaving den um, permanently. So let me go to start up. Just got out of work. Got out of work. Um, watch the Magic Mike live shave for the You're Not Down challenge. That was a fun video to watch. He's a beast. He took, um, loading up, took what, four shots? Four shots. He's, he's, he's now officially the king of the north. The GOT reference, yeah. So, you know, the other uh, Canadian guys out there got to get a lot to, uh, to prove to beat Magic Mike, to take his throne. Let's see. <laughs> All right, so I'm loading up. Um, such a good scent. I actually really, really like this scent. Really like it for me. All right. Oh, Kaizen loading up. Oh, face lathering up. Better is the word to use. All right. No, this not. It didn't dethrone, you know, my favorite silver tip knot, but it's it's up there. This one is, you know, I do, it's second preference to my silver tip knots and my brushes. I do like it more than synthetics. Just not quite enough to throw, like I said, dethrone my uh, silver tip brushes that I love so much that are just perfect for me. Got Iron Maiden playing, got an Iron Maiden playlist on shuffle. So we'll see what comes on. <sighs> Even lathered up, it's uh, very, very peach forward still. And for the free scents that I own from the a and &E, Asian Plum is still the number one. And this is the number two now. Need more 
water. And it's not, yeah, it's really nice. It's soft, so soft to the face. I haven't used an actual other bore knot, but this gel tip, it is soft. It is soft. I'm excited. I got a, another uh, gel tip, uh, gel silver tip brush coming in. Can't wait to try that one. I got a feeling that's going to be my number one, but we'll see. It's just a feeling, just a feeling. A little bit more water. <laughs> All right, let's paint this on a little bit more. Slickness, everything. This is Kaizen. You know what we're working with, guys. Phenomenal. And so now, Kaizen, definitely my favorite base to use. The scent, it's a great scent. I actually really like this one, you know, really good scent. Here we go. Cheers, guys. Actually, let me add just a little bit of, there we go. Check the other side. Yeah, a little bit of water, too. All right. First pass. First pass. Cheers. Actually, I'm going to go higher. I enjoy using this razor, but I, I think I like more of the hollow grinds than the wedge. The wedge, this one just, I don't know, I like that feedback from the hollows. This one just plows right through. Oh my god, this rag, we're to grab one. There you go, clean it off. Boom. All right. Where did I get my sideburn at? Actually, I'll fix that on the second pass. Actually, I think this is a, I'm gonna get this edge redone on it. And see if it's, uh, if it isn't the edge that, I wouldn't say it's bad, but um, it's not as enjoyable as some of my other razors. And this was one I did get off of eBay, and so far my eBay experience with edges hasn't been the best. So this, um, let's see if I get this home by somebody I trust and see if I'll make my experience better. I'm gonna go ahead and wet the face again. Hope you guys are all having a great day. Wednesday midweek shave. I was kind of lagging on the shave for a little bit because finally got word that my Sprecker is done. He uh, posted it, I forgot, Friday or Saturday, one of these days. I was hoping, you know, I would get it get it uh early this week it did it i needed to shave so that's the shave i'll do another shave once i get that one um i'll tell you more about shave gear news as well i 
also did order another custom brush from Smiles from Smiles for Miles. Excited for that. It's made of uh, it's skateboard decks. It's totally fucking cool. It's you know I told him the colors I wanted. He came out the he got it for me the pink and the green. Um, B the wash tail. It looks really cool. So I'm excited to try that one. That's the one I'm getting a, a V69 uh, gel tip nut on it. So I'm excited to try that. Can't wait for to get that one. I should. I know I'll probably have that one by the weekend. Second pass, get going. And actually, let me fix my sideburns. This one is right there. This one goes a little bit higher. All right. Across the grain. And I've been super swamped at work, so I'm just glad to finally relax and get a shave in. It's been busy, it is heat wave, everything. All right, get that in for the third and final pass and wet the face. And let's go, get this shade done. So when I get my Sprecher, I think I'm gonna do a live unboxing for that one. I haven't done anything live before, but I definitely will do the live unboxing for that one. I think that one's gonna be a little more of a special acquirement to the shave den, you know? Definitely with the price point on that, it's 
going to be a while before I ever get anything that pricey again. So definitely going to do a live unboxing of that. Going to do it on Lather and Blade. That's uh, one of my favorite chat rooms, groups to be in on Facebook. That one and the Wolf Pack. Those two are my favorite. All right. All right, third pass, guys. To get off. Let me use. I to fix this side burn. There you go. I think I got it. First time I cut up my sideburns higher with a straight razor, so I had a little little issue right there. All right, let me uh, wet the face and check for a little cleanup spot that I always have. All right.
I'm just chasing BBS. <laughs> all right, I'm all good. <sighs> all right, let me get this cup out of the way. Let me just over here. Let me wet the face, rinse off. All right, let's go for the splash. Oh, peach cognac, definitely a great set. Definitely a great set. Definitely probably like top five. Top five of my scents from Ariana and Evans. All right, so the, the splash smells a little darker. It's not as sweet as the puck. Maybe the peach, more of the cognac as well in this. And some of the other scents are coming through. I can't pick exactly what they are, but it's definitely a little, little muscular. Not as sweet as, as the puck. It's a good scent. I like this. I really do like this scent. And I uh, just want to thank you guys for watching. I want to thank you guys for joining me on another shave. I hope you guys have a, have a great day. And I'll see you next shave.